Hi, my name is Hannah, and today I'm teaching a breath for working through anxiety. So if you experience anxiety or anxiousness, this breath can help calm the nervous system. So we're going to start by, com by finding a comfortable seat. <laughs> and I'm going to sit here on my yoga mat with a blanket. However, you could do this breath practice anywhere. You could do it in your car, at the office, sitting on your bed, sitting on the couch, you decide. Wherever you're at though, wherever you end up, let's start by finding a nice tall spine. So sitting up nice and tall, we wanna create a lot of space for the lungs and the ribs and the diaphragm. Good. Option to have the palms face up or face down, maybe even resting on the belly, just to start. Okay, so let's start by taking a few deep breaths. Option to leave the eyes open or you could close the eyes, but wherever you're at, let's just start by noticing. So without changing the breath, without doing anything to manipulate it just yet, let's take a couple breaths here. It helps to have the hand over the belly, maybe even one hand over the chest just to notice and observe. Where do you naturally breathe? Are you breathing more into the chest? Do the ribs move? Does the belly move? There's no right or wrong. We're just noticing. With your next exhale, blow all of the air out of your lungs. Notice the belly flattens towards the spine, retreats from the hand. Big inhale through the nose, all the way down into the belly, up through the ribs and the chest. Exhale out of the mouth. Let's do one more, just like that. Big inhale, send your inhale all the way down to your belly button. Good. Now I'm taking a couple more deep breaths, but this time we're gonna exhale through the nose. Take your time, slow and steady. One more. Good. Let's release the hands from the chest and the belly. And let's take our right hand. So this is going to be a nostril breathing technique. We're gonna breathe in through the left nostril and exhale through the nose completely. If you find that breathing through the nose uh, makes you feel a little panicky or anxious, feel free to breathe out of the mouth. So in that case, you would be breathing in through the left nostril, exhaling out of the mouth. You decide what works best for you. We're gonna start by creating um, a hand posture, a mudra. So our first two fingers are gonna bend toward the palm and our last two fingers are gonna come together. Kinda looks like a shaka if you hold it out away from you, except for the difference is that our ring finger is joining the pinky finger, our thumb sticks out. We're gonna draw that in toward the chest and we're gonna start by plugging the right nostril with the thumb, inhale through the left. Remove the thumb, exhale through the nose. Good. And again, block off the right nostril, inhale through the left. Release the nostril, exhale. We're gonna continue that um, pattern and see if with each inhale and each exhale you can make it a little bit longer, a little bit smoother, a little slower. Take your time, there's no rush.
blocking off the right nostril with each inhale, sending the inhale through the left nostril, taking long, slow breaths, sending the breath all the way down into the belly, just like we did at the beginning. Releasing the right nostril, exhaling through the nose, nice and slow. Take your time. Let's take three more. Last one. Inhale through the left nostril. Exhale through the right. Or exhale out of your mouth through your nose. Release the hands down. And you can continue this for as long as you like. You can return to this breathing um, anytime that you need it. It's a very cooling breath. It cools the nervous system. It cools the body. And it's also great to do before bed if you find that you have some anxiousness um, or trouble falling asleep. So thank you so much for practicing with me today.